Hello, welcome to Megger's technical support video series, Frequently Asked Questions. In this video, we'll discuss how to download and install PowerDB Lite. Let's get started. PowerDB Installer is available at PowerDB.com. Once on this website, go to the download section where several installer options are presented. The option at the top of the list is the latest release. The installer file contains the three types of PowerDB, Pro, Advanced, and Lite. If you are a Pro user, check with your PowerDB system administrator before updating the software. The date next to the file name indicates the last time the drivers were updated. There could be several driver updates within the same release, meaning that the release number can remain the same, but the date can change. Below the first option, there are available versions for the STVIs and older releases. Click on the download button at, next to the version you are interested. In this case, we are downloading the latest release available. Follow the prompts to save the file to your computer. Once the download is completed, extract the PowerDB installation program prior to installing on your PC. Do not install from the zip file. After extracting the contents of the downloaded file, the new folder contains the installation program and the release notes where the changes to the new version are logged. Initiate the installation by double-clicking on the installation file. From this point, follow the prompts to complete the installation. Among the prompts, there's the license agreement, the selection of the destination folder for the software, the selection of the default settings to use, which can be changed later via the tools option in the menu. What you can select here is the language, the units, the frequency, the way to display the power factor results, which can be power factor or dissipation factor, and the standard to use, ANSI IC Australia. Next is the setup type. The options are light, advanced, and pro. If no license is available for Advanced or Pro, they will be installed in the Reader mode. The Lite version is the software that is included with the Mega instruments that are compatible with the PowerDB and it doesn't require a license. Right after the completion of PowerDB installation, a prompt for additional software shows up. The options are the drivers for the Mega Transformer Ohmmeter, the driver for the Mega Winding Analyzer, MWA, and the driver for the Power Factor test set, Delta 4000, and the name is Delta Control. If you have any of these instruments, you need to select them to be able to control these instruments. The driver for the other instruments that PowerDB Lite is compatible are included already in the installation that was already completed. Depending on the selected options, additional prompts will show up. Follow the process to complete the installation. During the installation of Delta Control, select the option to install it to control the Delta 4000 from PowerDB and Delta Manual Control, as shown in this screen. Once the optional driver's installation is completed, the software is ready to use. If there is any trouble opening or running the software, uninstall it and do a fresh installation by running the installer as administrator. This concludes the video on how to download and install PowerDB Lite. Visit the Mega YouTube channel for more videos, including technical webinars, product overviews, and other how-to presentations similar to this one. Contact us for questions or more information about this topic or for any support you may need for your electrical testing.